This week we're in Texas for the HQ Confidential Lexus Toyota Showcase event. One vehicle revealed is the new Lexus RX, which is the OG of the luxury crossover world. And for 2023, it's getting a complete redesign. This is the best selling Lexus in Canada. And I'm proud to say that the new RX will be built in Canada for the entire North American market and is based on the new global architecture K platform. The new platform enhances ride quality by offering more rigidity, a lower center of gravity, and it's lighter by 90 kilograms. The RX is the same length as the outgoing model. However, they have stretched the wheelbase and it's been extended by 60 millimeters or 2.4 inches. And this not only allows for a roomier cabin with more rear seat legroom, but a larger cargo area with a lower load in height. The looks of the new RX, in my opinion, is absolutely stunning. The spindle grille is seamless as it blends into the rest of the bodywork. It just seems to float there. 19 inch up to 21 inches are available depending on which package you get and I love the sweeping line that looks like it pinches the waist of the RX giving it a much more planted and flared out rear look. The roof line has been tapered in the back with that floating design and the back features the signature L-shaped taillights with the full length light bar and the stylish Lexus letters similar to that of the new Lexus NX. If you watched my Lexus NX review, you'll see some similarities in the new RX. There's the new e-latch system for the door mechanism. We have capacitive touch pads on the steering wheel for multi-purpose actions, an available 14 inch infotainment screen with the new Lexus interface, and of course, top-notch materials with impeccable fit and finish. There really is an RX for everyone with a choice of four different powertrains and they all come with standard all-wheel drive. First is the 350 and that comes with a 2.4 liter turbocharged four-cylinder with 275 horsepower. Next will be the RX 350H with a 2.5 liter four-cylinder with a hybrid system that comes in with 246 horsepower and a CVT transmission. Then we get the 450H, which will be the plug-in variant. We don't have any details on that one yet, but if it's anything like the NX 450H Plus that we drove, this is gonna be a home run for them. And new for those seeking more performance, there's the RX 500H F Sport. That'll feature a 2.4 liter turbocharged four-cylinder with a hybrid system. You get 367 horsepower. This comes with a six-speed automatic transmission, an E rear axle that'll feature a high output electric motor for more low-end torque for acceleration. This one even comes with six piston calipers for the brakes. The new RX really marks an evolution of the popular luxury crossover. This design is probably the most on point and cohesive from any Lexus SUV to date. With the increased space, capability, features, and so many different power plants, the new fifth generation RX will have no problem cementing himself at the top of the competitive luxury crossover market for years to come. Thanks for watching, and we will definitely share more info on this new RX when we get our hands on it, which will be hopefully soon.